Hello, it is going to be a wintry week. We have further Met Office yellow warnings in place for the next few days for ice and in some places snow as well. Now we had quite a bit of snow to start Monday from this little swirl you can see on the radar across parts of the southeast. Now through the morning that has been fizzling out, just the old flurry left here and there. But some snow showers coming in across northern Scotland. They will continue through the day. If anything, the snow is going to get heavier, especially across Shetland. We have the snow and ice warning in place here. And where we had the snow through the uh, first part of the day across the southeast, things likely to be icy here through today and overnight. Elsewhere, we've had some thick fog, and that is likely to stick over the Midlands, parts of northern England in particular, through the rest of today. And where the fog sticks, temperatures are really going to struggle to get much above freezing. Even where you've got a bit of sunshine, we're looking at highs generally of two or three degrees, maybe a little bit milder across the far southwest. Uh, even if we do get above freezing, temperatures will quickly drop back below freezing as we go through this evening. Perhaps we'll be as foggy across the southeast, but we'll still have some poor visibility over the Midlands and parts of northern England, staying quite murky here overnight. And, of course, wherever we've got any showers, there's the potential for things to be icy. And the snow showers still coming in on that brisk northeasterly wind across the far north of Scotland. It is going to be a cold night, minus three, minus four, even in towns and cities and across parts of Scotland. The border's getting down to negative double digits and across parts of northern Scotland. We could again get down to minus 15, maybe as low as minus 18 in some spots. So it is going to be a cold start to Tuesday. For most, it will be a, another dry day, but potential for things to be icy across the southeast. And we've still got snow showers coming in across northern Scotland, perhaps a few more down the uh, course of the day, moving into parts of northeast England and eastern Scotland too. Elsewhere, though, most places dry, quite a lot of cloud initially, but many places brightening up. Quite a lot of high clouds spilling into the south, though, here, so any sunshine will be fairly hazy. Notice the winds picking up in the far southwest as well. Temperatures here could get up to five, six degrees, but that wind will make it feel colder. Elsewhere, the wind's pretty light, but temperatures, again, struggling to get much above freezing. Then eyes down to the southwest as we potentially see a bit of wet weather just creeping in. Some uncertainty about how far in this is going to get, but wet weather hitting the colder air that could generate a bit of uh, snow. So that is something we're keeping an eye on as we go through Tuesday evening and overnight. Snow showers still coming in across northern Scotland and a few more coming down the eastern side also. So plenty going on over the next few days. That wet weather in the southwest is likely to skirt just to the south, tied into this area of low pressure. That's where the mild air is, but it stays to the south. And if anything, the air gets colder, dragged down across the UK through the rest of this week. So it is going to stay colder, potentially milder air back on the way as we go through the weekend and into it next week. But that is a long way off. Much of the rest of this week will all be about the cold, the frost, the ice, and in places, a little bit of snow. Keep up to date with those weather warnings. You can see them for yourself on our app or on our website and subscribe to our YouTube channels.